Guys, I am hungry. Whenever I shoot a haul, I usually do it on Saturdays and Sundays when I'm back from church and I don't have so much going on. So I use the opportunity to shoot a video. I'm hungry. I'm so happy I cooked yesterday. So I made rice. I made some stew. Let me show you guys. <laughs> so I made stew. I just put some onions on top. This is my jollof rice. This is my igosi. So I have enough food. So I got some groceries when I was heading back from church. I usually just pick bread, avocado. Those, you know, things for breakfast, basically. And yeah, let me show you guys my room. My room is in a mess. It's in a state. That's how my room looks whenever I do a fashion haul. Guys, it ain't easy. You know, sometimes when you see all of these videos, you think, you know, we just come here, just show, 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 and we're out. It takes a lot. <laughs> it takes a lot, but I'm grateful to God for his strength, for his grace, for giving me the power to remain consistent. Because, you know, there's sometimes, you know, we doubt ourselves, yeah, there's sometimes I also doubt myself. I'm like, what exactly am I doing? Why am I doing this? I sat down one day and I wrote my long term goals and I shot like things I would love to achieve through this plus from my fashion hauls, even through the other kind of videos that I make. And, you know, that gives me a sense of purpose, that gives me a sense of. You know like yeah I'll just keep on going like just keep on moving just keep on being consistent because you know what you never know you never know so if you're a secret out there just keep on moving and just keep on going just keep on being consistent keep being creative and you honestly don't know where this will lead you to so that is just my two cents my encouraging two cents because I'm also encouraging myself I am also encouraging myself because it ain't easy it ain't easy but even though sometimes the views doesn't match up with the videos i don't let that discourage me i don't let that discourage me i just keep on going keep on improving and keep on posting i keep on interacting with you all so um i want to go clean up do my sunday reset routine because Whenever I do this house, my room currently is in a state, which I'll show you guys now. So I need to just clear everything, put everything where it's supposed to be, and um, yeah, then eat. Just relax and then eat. So let's go and start cleaning things up. I feel so blue. Why do I feel so blue? Why do I feel so blue? Why do I feel so down? Why do I feel so blue? So guys, the lighting here in my room is not the best at all. <laughs> That's why I don't like vlogging here most times. So I'm about to just vacuum this place and I go sort out my groceries and clean up. I think I really prefer cleaning up nowadays on Sundays. So that's what I'm getting ready to do. So let's get to it quickly because I'm hungry. I've not eaten anything today aside from the chocolate and the banana bread I took in my church. That's about it. And I had to go to church early today because I'm an usher in my church and I need to be there on time. So I'm so hungry. So let's quickly get to this and show you guys what i picked up at the store whenever i'm done cleaning up my room i'm always spraying something just to make it smell good i don't use nothing on my rock i mean my rock smells good no smell at all but you know i just want to take this good smell to another level so i'm gonna be using my Fins Kamuto spray. I got this at TJ Maxx, so I just use this as my room spray now. And I also spray on my sheets too. No, just to make this place smell lovely. And this smells this smells incredible guys. This smells oh this smells so good. I don't want to look yellow. <laughs> I don't know what's up with the lightning in here. Let's see. Uh maybe this is better. So I'm about to clean up my living room. This is a mess. <laughs> this is a mess. I ate some biscuits here yesterday and there's some droplets here. So I just want to clean 
my space is usually not very dirty it's just most times so many clothes around and that's usually days i'm doing my fashion haul so this is not so much so i'm gonna get started with this quickly and sort out my groceries i'm gonna wash my bathroom toilet and the sink later on in this video okay <sighs> so guys oh you can see my mop and the mopping bucket there i'm done cleaning up oh, i'm so tired but let me show you guys quickly so this is what i usually do every sunday night just preparing me ahead for the week because my week is usually so busy you know you go get a nine to five so it can get so busy during the week so i love cleaning up on sunday just making sure everywhere it's sparkling neat because i can't function in a messy environment so so last night to do now is to unpack my groceries i got these groceries when i immediately after church i stopped by at the grocery shop so i just got i have here a tropical punch it's been a while since i've tried minutes made so i just wanted to try it again <laughs> i was craving for something really sweet and i think this tropical punch would be really really sweet and i got me bread oh, guys, i've been looking for this particular bread so so good this is what i use for my post bread i was so happy i was able to find this and i got some gum to keep me awake when i'm feeling sleepy be it at work or at church so i'm always picking up this and i got a whole lot of pack you know whenever i go to the grocery shop i'm always coming back with an extra 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 bag because i use this for my trash so i have here first i'm trying to create some healthy eating and i have mushroom here i don't know i was craving for mushroom i was craving for mushroom i want to use this for my spaghetti so much on when i'm working from home and this is just the usual oopsie wow wow <laughs> wow <laughs> so i have here i think this is ripe already yes so i'm gonna eat this today i have here avocados some fresh tomatoes and last but not the least some fresh green ball yellow ball and red ball pepper oh, so guys um that's about it today it's been a long day for me after shooting the video which i need to plan myself properly because the fashion haul that i did i didn't show two other outfits and yeah i need to make sure i'm more organized when i'm doing my fashion hauls because i was supposed to show two extra outfits which i didn't so but i'll keep that in mind going forward happy thursday yeah <laughs> i didn't pick up my camera at all yesterday i was just having a really gloomy day and today yesterday we had a snowstorm here so no movement for me <laughs> i was just at home thank god i had everything i needed in my house so nothing was taking me out and yeah I don't know my legs i just feel so cold my feet feel so cold and my hair is on i just at this point i just don't even know what else to do and i think my workstation has something to do with it because i was really really thinking of getting a standing desk my workstation my table basically is just not like on my lap is really low leveled and you know at times i just want to stretch it's just inconveniencing so i'm honestly thinking of upgrading to a standing deck so i'm honestly thinking about it so yeah yeah i'm just having a really really gloomy day still today so yeah guys that's just about it today just work nothing much i edited my much reset video already 
my recent video which has which will go up soon I'm about to just eat now I'm so tired guys I'm just so tired I just want to eat so watch TV and relax nothing more ah, let's have dinner I think for dinner I want to eat so I feel like eating swallow because I made a goosey soup on Saturday so I'm just thinking I have a goosey soup, I have jello fries and I have stew but I have no rice so stew is out of it <sighs> probably I'll make a goosey soup yeah that's what I'm going to have tonight so let's go make my swallow <laughs> So guys, this right here is the goosey soup I made on Saturday, so I'll just warm part of this and we'll have dinner. Hi y'all, it is Friday and so yeah, I just showed you see that video. I'm so excited that went so well. I'm trying to build my community, build a community rather, of young women, strong young women purposeful young woman and just you know little tips here and there that can help us live a more purposeful fruitful happy 20s so yeah i have i have time today so i decided to work on my closets i have always wanted to clear some of my clothing because i have some clothing that it's been a while since I've worn. I don't wear them again. Some I have outgrown. Some they are old. I just want to get rid of them rather than me just having them all hanged in here and I don't wear them. So that's what we're going to do today. And um, I have <clears throat> some clothing in my box down there. But I'll first sort out these ones right here and see which one I don't wear frequently, which one I don't like again. I just bring them out. Yeah, I just want to declutter my space. I hate having so many things. I don't know. You should have known that on this channel. I said I a lot. I'm trying to have that minimalistic lifestyle. Of course, I'm not there yet. 100% there yet. But I try. So let's just go straight right into bringing out outfits that I don't wear often. So guys, this is one here. This is what I wore for my graduation. And I haven't worn it since my graduation. This is a really cute blue dress so i'm gonna give out this this right here is a bodysuit that i really don't like i think i got this from shane yeah i just don't feel this whenever i wear it so this also this also is good <laughs> so it has i think i need to try this again before i make my mind on this one i'll try this one again and see how it fits on me but i have never worn this dress never this also is going. I've had this for over, I think, two years now. <laughs> hey, that's right. That's right for me. So, guys, I had this before. These are the ones I brought out since I think beginning of this year. These are some good outfits too. Literally, this one. I got this when I was doing my I think Zara or Mango Fashion Point. I haven't worn it since then and literally this doesn't fit me so well again. It's super super tight. So I said ah it's quite unfortunate. So I'm gonna bring out my box. I have a box which I have a lot of clothes in there too. So I'm gonna break that one out and sort through and see what I can give out from there. So the box I brought to the US when I moved for school. <laughs> sweet sweet memories. So yeah okay oh my gosh guys these outfits here i saw these literally back in nigeria there was one time i felt i wanted to be a fashion designer for some weird reason so i went to the market cut out i cut out this material i mean i told the tailor my idea what i wanted and the colors i wanted to use and she came up with this and i designed the outfit and i gave it to the tailor to help me bring it to life and i told her the colors the kind of material i wanted to use and yeah i'm not gonna give this out because i've never worn this and it's it's yeah it's just i just find it really interesting <laughs> so i'll still keep this one with me it's right here i don't know what's going on with this dress but yes so guys that's about it i don't know if you're like me i feel i have 
this kind of attachment to my things that I find it hard to let go at times. Am I the only one? If you're the same way, let me know down in the comment section. But I feel so attached to my stuff. So I'm like, oh, even though I like this so much, and even the one I gave it out, just that attachments. I don't know. I don't know, but yeah, I'm I'm done sorting things out. So this is the current state of things. This one's right here. Going. That's laundry. So. Anyways, little by little, as the days goes by, if I see anyone also that I feel needs to go, it will go because, yeah, there's no point having a lot of things that you don't wear and you don't like just sitting there in your closet. Give it out to people that need them. So, yeah, I would catch up with you guys. Let me clear this area, go have my baths, clean up and relax. I'll see you guys soon, okay? Okay. It's essential to try this dress I saw in my wardrobe. I've not worn this dress out, so I got this from Shane and oops, I can wear this for vacations, giving me vacation vibes. Yes, so cute, so, so cute. I just wanted to show you guys what I picked up and pretty new. Over two years now, two years in my closet, doing nothing. Nothing at all, and I'm not wearing no brand. It's, it's, it's holding up well, it's holding up really really nice so yeah let me let me go continue my cleanup catch up with you guys soon okay okay yeah. <laughs> so guys i'm gonna show you guys where i got i want to start doing my nails myself and only fix on occasions not special occasions on occasions yeah <laughs> so i got this oh why did i buy this why did i buy this i think i'm gonna return this a led lamp but this is like the low budget led lamp and i didn't really pay attention to this so i'm gonna return this i'm gonna keep the receipts i'm gonna return this i didn't pay close attention to it i was thinking I was thinking it's the ones you can just put your hands in but yeah this is low budget and this won't get the job done so i'm gonna return this and get a proper one from amazon when i get my things i try just get get something good once and for all rather than going cheap and at the end of the day it spoils on time or it doesn't do the job well so i rather just close my eyes and buy the quality products a nail file and new polish remover to remove the ones i already have on and i have so she recommended this to me so this is the nail builder i don't know but she said this will make a difference whenever i use it so yeah i had this before but i don't know where i kept it so i decided to just buy buy this again but if i find i'll check for it today if i'm able to find this then i'll return this with when i'm returning the red lamp and i got me red i've been craving for a red nail polish so i got this so that's about it guys that's about it cutting moves to help pick out my nails so i'll put all of this where it's supposed to be and i will yeah go edit my video and chill that's my plan for the rest of the weekend for saturday that's this first time i'm just picking my camera i've been editing all day oh my goodness editing takes a lot of time <laughs> and for my fashion hauls i'm trying different different things i'm trying to spice things up my fashion haul so it's just be the same old same old so i'm trying to see how i can work with more music when i do my fashion haul so that took a while <laughs> but i'm done with it it's currently exporting now that's my laptop there so as i was sporting i quickly went to sally's beauty i got i remember i said yesterday i wanted to make my nails myself so i got the uv thingy <laughs> but i don't like the one i got from sally's beauty beauty it seems yeah it wouldn't do the job it's yeah it's giving <laughs> It's giving low quality so i went to return that today and i stopped by to get my usual groceries for the week and i got my favorite i need to 
I want to make this thing. I really want to make this thing for myself one day, but I need to buy my baking equipment because <laughs> I don't have good baking equipment. So I want something that would be more efficient so I don't have to start steering myself. Anyways, that's by the way. So I picked up some groceries that's right here. Yeah, nothing much guys that's about it and yeah church i had a wonderful time in church today oh my god the shots i'm going back to listen to the service the preaching for today because he talked the pastor talked about abundance and that's something that i really resonated with you know we are, sometimes as humans we limit ourselves we feel we can't achieve our goals we feel we can't achieve our dreams or we feel they are too big but you know what when you think abundance when you have that mindset of i can achieve this i'm going to achieve this and i mean it's not just by saying it's also working towards it so when you have that mindset and you work towards your goal i believe everything is possible of course it might take it might take a while i mean you wouldn't achieve sometimes it wouldn't come like this up when we want it but it will surely happen it surely happen so it's just me encouraging you <laughs> encouraging myself to do not think do not think small yeah think big think big don't limit yourself have that abundance Abund is it abundance or abundance the thing is abundance have that abundance mindset so yeah that's just my <laughs> two cents <laughs> what i what i really what i learned in church today and that's something that i would carry on with me and i will go back and listen because it was really encouraging and yeah so let me unpack and i would boil my rice i've not eaten anything today i for breakfast so i'm hungry <laughs> We must be meant for each other, girl. Oh, yeah. Baby, don't fight it. Babe, sun don't shine when you go away. Hey, baby, won't you come home right now? Baby, won't you come home right now? Yeah, need to know that you okay. My fake plant is all cleaned up now. I don't understand. Guys, I just had a scare. <laughs> so I went to just throw the trash just down the walkway. And I saw this guy with his speed bulldog. Oh my goodness, my heart skipped the beats because I've heard so many stories of pit bull. Like they literally can kill someone. <laughs> so when I saw the pit bull dog, my heart skipped a bit, but I realized the guy he had something over the the dog's mouth. I'm like, why <sighs> Why do you still have that breed of dog as pets? It just doesn't make sense to me. But anyways, I'm like, you better hold your dog. <laughs> you better hold your dog. So the guy with the pit bull, they passed and there was another one coming. Oh my goodness. There was another lady with her dog and that one, that one just started barking like what I don't know. I was literally, I was, I was scared. <laughs> I honestly don't like dogs, like the big, big dogs now. I don't like it. Yes, yeah, so I'm done. I'm done for today, guys. Um, just want to shower. <sighs> yeah, I'm tired. I'm tired and I, I need to eat. But first of all, we'll do laundry. Then I go shower and I eat. And then relax and watch some good YouTube videos. Okay. With everything I gave up for you, did it for love. No escaping, heart is taken. I've been waiting, I've been patient. Thought you been down, heard you skip down, and can't be found. Where are you now, baby? Deep down. How are you guys doing? So, guys, I have nothing much going on today. I. It's Friday, so I'm just wrapping up for the week making sure i'm crossing my eyes and biting my teeth so i just showered and i was watching my one of my old videos and i remember in the video i was watching towards the end of the video i was saying so guys please get me to 200 subscribers please and now i'm on 308 and i was just like wow slowly but surely just keep on going 
keep on doing your work keep on improving your craft you never know so guys i just put on this beautiful dress my mom got for me and i said to myself did i add weight because this dress was literally on my knees but now it is way above my knee so guys this is a cute dress my mom say go for me yes my mom still gets me dresses <laughs> so yeah last time i wore it it was literally here on my knees yeah if i added some heights i just don't know but it's cute i really like it so i'm gonna use this to just chill at home this is more like my lounge wear and guys i forgot to mention so <laughs> the weather has been good i'm so happy we're finally leaving the winter season gradually going to spring and then summer <sighs> i can't wait <laughs> i cannot wait to put on all my bum shorts all my short gowns i honestly can't wait for summer so yeah guys i just wanted to hop in here to I'll show you guys my cute dress <laughs> that's yeah my cute dress so i'll catch you guys later and i want to get something to eat now then figure out what we're doing today <laughs> because i have nothing planned but i plan to go to the gym later today later this evening but we'll see how that goes so my love this is my gym outfit for today i have my lightweight top here i'll take this off when i start becoming sweaty sweaty so guys i don't know i feel i'll be going to the gym have been consistent to the gym yeah but i just feel i'm not seeing any results <laughs> that's because i really want to lose very fast yes this is this this needs to go but i don't know i've not been seeing progress and i'm like i'm not seeing anything why do i still have a bump here <laughs> but yeah i will just keep on being consistent so I'll keep on staying consistent and we'll see hopefully but aside from that i feel fit like my body feels good that's one thing that i'm so happy about I, my body feels good even though it seems like i can't see any um, any changes yet so i know it's it's an information process that will come so i'm heading to the gym now guys i'll catch up with you guys later yeah so this is my this is my gym bag this catcher's bag so whenever i go to the gym i just put my purse here water and my airpods kit that's about it going to the gym i have just eight minutes left this was sunday so my purse my airpods a bubble gum which i would open up my water so this is my gym wear and here yeah, i didn't do anything to my hair because said i'm going to work out so, so i'll catch up with you guys later now baby deep down i know you've been missing me but you keep being a mystery Dang. Don't know if you recall it, but last time I said the sun won't shine till we meet again. Be waiting all these stormy night, oh yeah, stormy night, oh yeah. <sighs> so guys, I am done for the night. Just lit my candle and about to just chill. It's to ten. Also go to bed because tomorrow is under work wonderful work week so i'm mentally ready for that already because <laughs> i know this week's gonna be busy but yeah i'm ready um i will see you guys tomorrow monday hopefully see you guys i'm heading to my couch now to relax and i would see you guys later